Weather on the East Coast has delayed or canceled nearly 200 flights at OIA alone today, and the cold forced at least one airline to break out de-icing equipment, something that other airlines don't even have. Channel 9's Field Sutton's been tracking flights that went out hours late after waiting to thaw out this morning. He continues our team coverage live at OIA, and Field, things are still backed up because of this at the airport. They are, and it's likely to continue into tomorrow because already passengers here are being told their flights to the northeast may not go out until Saturday. I want you to look at the boards right now. Look up at this corner. All of that red is the New York, Newark, Philly flights. It's all red because they're not going anywhere. All over the airport this afternoon, you'll find families stranded. I checked my email early, early this morning around 545 and got notification that our flight was canceled. Heather Davis told me she spent most of the morning trying to rebook. So I immediately called Southwest and they said the earliest we can get on was 545 tonight. This morning, Southwest was one of the few airlines with de-icing equipment available to quickly thaw out frozen planes. The airport itself doesn't own de-icing equipment. And one man flying Delta today told me he ended up leaving for Indianapolis hours late. They told us that they didn't really have anything to de-ice because it's never this cold in Orlando. Tim Rock and his fellow passengers were surprised Delta didn't have something like this, which Southwest calls a hot shot because it sprays hot de-icing fluid on the planes. He basically said, we're going to have to wait till the sun comes up. He was waiting for the sun in the morning, and Davis yeah, is waiting for better weather tonight. I know it's cold back home, but I didn't think we would get impacted by the snow. She and her family are worried even their new flight will cancel, and they'll be left scrambling for another way home. Well, most of the major airlines have not responded to my questions about what de-icing equipment they have here at OIA. Of course, you saw Southwest does have some. American Airlines tells me it does not. But we're in for another cold night. If you're flying out first thing tomorrow morning, you probably want to be pretty patient. Live at OIA, Field Sutton, Channel 9, Eyewitness News.